Hey everyone, this is Daily Dose of Medicine. In this video, we will talk about high blood sugar, which is also known as hyperglycemia. It occurs when the level of glucose in your bloodstream rises above normal. In this video, we will talk the causes, signs and symptoms of high blood sugar, and complications and management. Let's start with causes. The most common cause of high blood sugar is diabetes mellitus. There are two main types, type 1 and 2. Briefly, type 1 is an autoimmune condition where the immune system mistakenly attacks and destroys insulin-producing cells in the pancreas. Type 2 is characterized by insulin resistance where the body's cells do not respond properly to insulin. This leads to an inability to effectively regulate your blood sugar levels. Another factor can, that can cause high blood sugar levels is stress. We have a video on that. You can find it on top right corner. Physical and emotional stress can cause the body to release hormones like cortisol and adrenaline. These hormones can lead to increased blood sugar levels as the body prepares to respond to stress. Medications like corticosteroids can interfere with insulin function and lead to elevated sugar levels. Another factor is illness and infections. Infections, especially if they cause fever, can trigger the release of stress hormones, which in turn can increase blood sugar levels. Poor diet, consuming excessive amounts of sugary foods and drinks can cause rapid spike in blood sugar levels. A diet high in refined carbohydrates and sugars can contribute to chronic high blood sugar levels over time. Lack of physical activity causing high blood sugar levels because physical activity helps the body use glucose for energy. Lack of exercise can lead to insulin resistance and higher blood sugar levels. Hormonal changes in conditions like PCOS, polycystic ovary syndrome, and hormonal imbalances overall can contribute to insulin resistance and subsequently high blood sugar levels. Now that we have talked about the causes, let's talk about signs and symptoms of high blood sugar. We will talk about the most common signs and symptoms. Recognizing the signs and symptoms of high blood sugar is important for timely intervention. And let's get started. The first one we will talk is excessive thirst and hunger, I think, which is the most important one. High blood sugar can lead to increased thirst, which is known as polydipsia, and hunger, which is known as polyphagia, as the body tries to eliminate excess glucose. Frequent urination is another important sign. Excess glucose in the bloodstream is eliminated through urine, leading to more frequent urination, known as polyuria. Fatigue is another common symptom. High blood sugar levels can result in reduced energy levels and persistent fatigue. Blurred vision, elevated blood sugar can affect the lens of the eye, causing temporary blurred vision. Slow healing, high blood sugar can impair the body's ability to heal wounds and infections. Weight loss, Especially unexplained weight loss can occur due to the body breaking down muscle and fat for energy in the absence of sufficient glucose uptake by cells. Irritability, especially fluctuations in blood sugar levels, can lead to mood swings and irritability. Numbness and tingling, prolonged high blood sugar can damage nerves, leading to sensations of numbness and tingling, particularly in extremities. If left unmanaged, it can lead to serious health complications. Let's talk about the complications now. Diabetic ketoacidosis, known as DKA, a potentially life-threatening condition that occurs when the body starts breaking down fat for energy, leading to accumulation of acidic ketones in the blood. Another severe condition is hyperosmolar hyperglycemic state, which is a severe condition characterized by extremely high blood sugar levels and severe dehydration. These are the important complications of diabetes, uncontrolled high blood sugar. Cardiovascular issues, chronic high blood sugar increases the risk of heart disease, stroke, and high blood pressure. 
nerve damage. Well, high blood sugar can damage nerves, leading to neuropathy, which can cause pain, numbness, and decreased sensation. Kidney damage, because of the kidney filter blood and high blood sugar can damage their filtering units, leading to diabetic nephropathy. It can lead to eye problems. High blood sugar can damage blood vessels in the retina, leading to diabetic retinopathy, which can cause vision loss. Managing high blood sugar involves a combination of lifestyle changes, medications, and regular monitoring. We have talked about signs and symptoms, causes, and complications. Let's talk about the management. Here are some key strategies. The first and probably one of the most important one is healthy diet. Focus on a balanced diet rich in whole grains, lean proteins, vegetables and fruits. Limit sugary and refined foods. Physical activity, engage in regular exercise to improve insulin sensitivity and help regulate blood sugar levels. Medications are important as well for individuals with diabetes. Medications like insulin or oral anti-diabetic drugs may be prescribed by a healthcare provider to control high blood sugar levels. Regular monitoring is important. Monitor your blood sugar levels regularly using glucose meters to track progress and make necessary adjustments. It could be about lifestyle changes or medication changes. Stress management, we have talked how stress can lead to high blood sugar levels. So if you practice stress reduction techniques like med meditation, deep breathing, and yoga, you can minimize the impact of stress on blood sugar levels. Stay hydrated to help prevent spikes in blood sugar levels. Try to stay hydrated as much as you can. If you are overweight, losing a, even a modest amount of weight can improve insulin sensitivity try to manage your weight medical care is important regular checkups with healthcare professionals are essential to monitor blood sugar levels assess overall health and adjust treatment plans in conclusion high blood sugar is a serious condition with potential long-term health consequences by making lifestyle changes adhering the medical advice and staying proactive in monitoring blood sugar levels, individuals can better manage their condition and reduce the risk of complications. Always consult with a healthcare professional for personalized guidance and treatment. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like this video. Share this video with your friends. Don't forget to watch our signs of diabetes and how to detox pancreas videos. Don't forget to watch folate deficiency signs video and see you on the next one.